I'm on the search for the next Tesla stock that's gonna help me get close to my goal of $10,493.14 in passive income in four years to prove the American dream is still alive and possible for anyone. There's no mountain I won't climb, no desert I won't cross on my quest to financial freedom. Go, one, go to South Beach to find the next Tesla. What is the next Tesla stock? Um, Hot Cheetos. Hot Cheetos. Two, invest $1,000 into the next Tesla. A few videos ago, one of you, and by one of you, I mean my friend Carol, asked me to do a review on Tilray Inc. Although there's huge potential there, it just didn't fit into my $10,493.14 passive income goal within the time frame I needed it to. The risk reward factor was not there for me. This past week, my buddy Aqua from Aquaman Beats hit me up and was like, Hey, what's up, Sean? Hey, I got a question for you, man. I got yeah. $1,000 to invest, and I want to know what's the next Tesla gonna be. The next Tesla. Look, I'm not a financial advisor. If you need financial advice, seek guidance from a trained professional. But if I had $1,000 and wanted to invest in the next Tesla, I would invest in. I'm a one to one, I can never be you. Low me tools, no, I can't be fooled. Low me tools, no, I hate these dudes. I'm a one to one, I can never be you. I can never be you. What's up, y'all? Sean McMurray, and this is Analytical Overdrives. Investing <laughs> Look, my boy Aqua posed a great question. We are always on the search for the next Tesla or the next Amazon that's going to make us an instant millionaire. An instant millionaire fits into my $10,493.14 passive income in four years goal. So I started my search for the next Tesla. Check it. My boy hit me up. He's like, look, I have $1,000. Mm -hmm. What do I invest in? What is the next Tesla? So if you had a thousand, what would you invest in? I will buy stocks. I will either do Fashion Nova or Amazon because a lot of people, girls, I have Fashion Nova on right now. Amazon, everybody oh. shops there. Dope. So that would be a good investment for me. Now I'm here with the hustler of the year. Clarissa? Teresa? Gladisa. Gladisa. Ah, oh, dope. Where are you from, Gladisa? Um, I live here, but I moved here from Arizona. Ah, oh, dope, dope, dope. All right, so she's a local just like us. And uh, so here's the question. My boy hit me up. He's like, look, I have $1,000. What's the next Tesla? What's the next stock to invest in? So if you had $1,000, crypto or stock, what would you invest in? I would be a little bit more on the safe side and invest in, like, Microsoft. Dope. Just um, with $1,000, I would... That I know that's gonna in the long term it's gonna increase. Um, for the next Tesla, I would like to find that out as well. I'm not that much into investing okay. or research, but okay. I'll probably do Microsoft. Well, well, so a man said he has a thousand dollars. He's looking for the next Tesla. The next Tesla. What's the next Tesla? Crypto or stock to invest in? If you had a thousand, what would it be? Uh huh. So if I had a thousand, I'm splitting it. Um, five hundred is gonna go into stocks. Five hundred is going into crypto. Dope. Um, for stocks, I'm throwing it into Palantir Technologies. Dope. Um, you heard of that one? Or that's, no? a, that's actually a dope pick. I actually own Palantir. I, yeah. after, after Kathy Wood yeah. gave a suggestion, yeah, yeah. right? Run I, 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 I didn't like their financials, but after Kathy endorsed them, I was like, yeah. okay, I yeah. got to get behind that. They got mad government contracts, and I think that's yep. going to propel them. I feel like any company that gets in good with the government is good. Oh, 100%. Um, and it's a data company, and I feel like data is king in this, this day and age. Absolutely. Um, and then for crypto, I'm throwing 500 into Engine Coin. Today I'm here with... Alondra. Emmeline. Drea. <laughs> and we've asked them the question, what is the next Tesla stock? Um, Hot Cheetos. Hot Cheetos. I received a bunch of great advice and a few haters. But I realized more research is needed. So back to the drawing board. I turned to the almighty Google and asked the question, what is the next Tesla? After hours of research, what? I needed a break. I found it. There were five things that drew me to this stock. One, 
you are buying at a discount. Two, it has market lead with its technology and market share. Three, multiple avenues of revenue via its disruptive technology in both industries. Four, their passionate CEO. The most important thing is you are buying this stock at a discount. If you had bought in one year ago, you would have experienced a 556% increase in value. And if you invest today, you would be buying at another 504% discount over the expected price in four years. Market lead. This company has been working on their technology for at least 17 years and are light years ahead of anyone else within their industry. They are probably the closest to achieving a truly driverless car and recent announcements around their battery technology pushes them further in the lead. As far as market share, this company owns 79% of the electric car market in the US as of February of this year. Multiple avenues of revenue. You can't look at this company like an automobile manufacturer, but more like a technology company. Although they started out with electric vehicles, they've expanded into providing clean energy and energy storage products. Their solar division is up 198% year over year as of Q4 2020 and 109% quarter over quarter. Their passionate CEO. Their CEO is probably one of my favorite CEOs. He's cool, he's hip, he takes the status quo of what a successful CEO is supposed to be and look like and Irish tap dances on its head. There's only one other CEO in my lifetime that was as passionate and as knowledgeable as his engineers about the company and what they are doing. I'd invest in this company purely because my faith and belief in the CEO. Look, if you haven't figured it out, the next Tesla is, well, Tesla. We're so busy looking for the next Tesla or the next Amazon that we get blinded by the fact that we have the Tesla, which is still an amazing company that is expected to see amazing growth. Tesla will continue to evolve and continue to be a disruptor with Elon Musk at the helm. I'm doubling down on Tesla. And, well, I'm out. Yeah.